four inch hard pipe. Four inch hard pipe. As few and kinks do not as put possible. screws in the joints. Shortest, shortest length possible. Just a few elbows. Um, and when you when you uh, you tape the joints with silver uh, foil back tape. <coughs> Don't use uh, screws because screws go in the pipe and then it's lint gets stuck on them. Mm -hmm. So. I'll be um, did you see the gas pipe that goes up to the kitchen? Oh, that. That's that. probably in there, maybe. Uh, that because the kitchen would be right up over here. Oh. It could be in the other room too. Okay. And that's an interesting room. The floor's got this thing at the bottom. Really? Where that cement is, it's almost like it. Oh, there you go. That smells moldy. There's the gas line going up to the stove. Okay. And it's would there right be here. a shutoff valve? It's right here. The shutoff valve is supposed to be above the floor. Oh, okay. And I think I looked behind it. And I think there was a shutoff valve, but we'll go, we can verify. Okay. That gas valve not only goes up, but it comes down the Would wall. this be telephone or cable? No, this is, this is a security alarm system that's oh, all been cut. Oh, gotcha. No longer doing anything. Okay. They had a security system in the house at one point. Okay. This gas line, up to the stove okay and I can see there's a T there and it's a pipe and it's going down down into this down into this brick that's good or bad or wow. indifferent or don't know where it goes oh okay okay I'm not ready to look at all this yet okay <laughs> <laughs> we're still in this room okay okay let's see this is asbestos oh that's not good this this white tape um, not this, but this white tape, that white tape, this white tape, that's asbestos, and this is considered friable. And there's two kinds of asbestos. There's friable and non-friable. Friable asbestos is the kind that you can actually, um, if it breaks and flakes loose, it can actually float into the air and you can breathe in the fibers. That's the bad kind. Non-friable is the kind of asbestos that might be encapsulated in floor tile, and it's not going to come loose unless you drill and create a dust. So, I'll recommend that the asbestos be removed by L&L &L insulation. Okay. They can usually go into a house and it's usually about a thousand dollars to remove the asbestos. If you don't want to do that or pay for that or they don't want to pay for it or the, the second option is to have it encapsulated so that it doesn't come loose because right now it's never been encapsulated. You see it's loose. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just tape. So. It's not the really. It's not the worst kind of friable. Right. The worst kind is like insulation that's real thick. Right. So just to do that little bit right there is a thousand dollars. Oh, but they'll do the whole house. Oh. However much is in here. Oh. It's usually on the ductwork. So the way you encapsulate it is just buy a can of spray paint and you just spray paint it all, and then that encapsulates encapsulates it inside the paint, and then it's not a. Gotcha. It's okay. Gotcha. Okay, um, the only issues in the laundry um, really is just uh, I'm going to recommend that four inch hard pipe. Okay. Make notes on that and then we'll start going, looking around this basement. Okay. And I'll do the furnace and air conditioner and water heater and that mechanical stuff okay. at the end.